Yo guys, it's Clay here, back with another YouTube video. Today we're going to be checking out the Lackman sub in Modern Warfare 2 beta. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you're new to the channel, hit that sub button. And also hit that like button. Hitting the like button is the easiest way to support my channel. And it pushes the video out into YouTube algorithm so other people can see it. Another way to help out with the YouTube algorithm is to comment something down in the comments. It could be about the channel, it could be about the video, or it could just be a random emoji. Anything helps. All right, so before getting into the attachments, I had to record all of this on my PlayStation 5. For some reason, my Elgato wasn't working. So this is going to be a little scuffed, and I will have to go by what the video is doing. But getting into the attachments on the barrel, I am going to be using the FTAC M sub 12 inch barrel. It gives bullet velocity, damage range, hit fire accuracy, and recoil control. I will have two MP5 class setups for you guys because I can't really remember which one I use. But I hope you guys stick around for the second one. Alright, so for the muzzle, I'm going to be using the Lockshot KT85 muzzle. It gives horizontal recoil control and vertical recoil control. I noticed that visual recoil is really, really bad in this game, and this helps out a lot. Alright, so for the underbarrel, I'm going to be using the Lock Grip Precision 40 for the hitfire accuracy, gun kick control, and aim walking steadiness. The cons are aim down sight speed, but I think you're mainly aiming down sights in this beta, so it doesn't really matter. And for the ammunition, I'm going to be using the 9mm hollow points. It gives crippling power. It basically disables movement, but it does take away bullet velocity and bullet penetration, so you got to be careful with that. On the stock, I'm going to be using the no stock. I love movement speed, and this is it gives the right amount that I need. And it also adds aim down sight speed, sprint to fire speed, and hip fire recoil control. The MP5 reminds me just like the MW. 2019 mp5 and this is the build that i think i went with in the gameplay i can't really remember because it was last night and i was up all night grinding all right for the second mp5 class setup i'm just gonna quickly go over what the attachments i put on i put on the no stock for the stock the 40 round magazine and the vx pineapple vert grip for the underbarrel the lackman pulser for the barrel and if I was to put on anything else, it would probably be some ammunition. I would probably put on hollow points, just like I did on the other build. Or I would put on rear grip, if anything adds to the aim down side speed. This MP5 was mainly for movement, and I probably didn't put on any other attachment because of that. I think all the other ones took off movement speed. So you guys can try that build if you want. If not, it is what it is. I have a gameplay for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Hit that like button, and I'll see you in the next one. Copy that, UAV online and orbiting the AO. No signal from the UAV, recon is down. The enemy holds all objectives, secure those positions. Switching max! We're taking Bravo. Throwing stun grenade. Sentex out. Thank 
Loading press. Switching Max! out! Throwing stun grenade! Throwing stun grenade!
Throwing grenade out! Incoming. Enemy UAV active. We're getting hit 